You knew this video was coming because I've used it in a billion videos. I'm reviewing one of my favorite top coats, the Born Pretty Water Base Peel Off Top Coat Base Coat. So yeah, and but before we get on to that video, don't forget to give this video a like if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to subscribe. Oh, and hit that bell ah, really loud. to get a notification from me when I upload. On to the review! strong. Okay, first up guys, I'm going to tell you the pros and the cons about this top coat and base coat. First of all, I'll tell you the pros because I love this top coat base coat. For one thing, it is a top coat and base coat. I do not use it for base coat. I only use it for top coat because it works beautifully on foil. Now, if anybody does foil or have ever done foil or do foil, you notice that normal top coats can ruin your foil. Foil, meaning I'm talking about, foil being this color for paper, normally that foil is used with gel. Now, um, if you don't have uh, gel and uh, you need gel and I'd like to cure your gel, of course, if you do not have that and you don't have the money to spend on a watered base top coat that I've noticed is around maybe eleven dollars when I uh, looked it up, and I would want you would want a cheaper route. And this bottle of Born Pretty peel off is only uh, two dollars and thirty nine cents on like eBay. I bought it off of eBay for that much money, and that would that is a lot less money than the other watered uh, base top coats I've seen, and it's definitely less money than gel. So I wanted a cheap alternative to putting on foil, but not ruining my foil, and it works really good on foil. So the pro for those so the pro here is it works really good on foil. I paint this over my foil, I let it dry, I put a normal top coat over it. Of course, this would peel off because it's peel off, but I put a normal top coat on it. So, and then I let that dry, and then you have perfectly foiled nails with no gel and no expensive water-based top coats. So, yes, that is the best thing about this. The fact that it works really good on foil and that it's cheap. And another pro of it is if you do nails and you do like, let's say you have like red flowers and you have a light base coat and you you know how when it just drags and kind of seeps down like those red lines, red veins and stuff like that, that is like never going to happen with this wonderful, awesome top coat because it's just made for no smudging. It's made by Born Pretty, so I think it would work on those kind of things because if you think about it, you wouldn't want to, if you stamp, because they, they sell a bunch of million everything about stamping, so if you would stamp with red, you wouldn't want that to smear, so I get it why this top coat's really good for that. And uh, yeah, let's go on to the cons. The cons are if you do, uh, you know how you put a dot of top coat on your nail and then you put a rhinestone on? It does not work with that. It's a water base and it does not work with like placing rhinestones on your nail, you know? So you cannot uh, use this to put, I've learned that I used it for that and the rhinestones just came right off. They, it doesn't work for that. This is a top coat and base coat peel off, so um, it will peel off. Now some peel off uh, base coats, I would not use it for base coat because I don't want it to peel off usually because, you know, sometimes peel off base coats, they last for a while, but for me they last for one day. So I don't use it for base coat. So I wouldn't probably use it for base coat because I think it would peel off way quicker than you wanted to do unless you really wanted it to peel off really fast, like in one day, that's fine. But usually I don't want it to peel off in one day. So I don't use it for base coat. I only use it for a top coat and it's a really good top coat. I probably, another thing I want to do is when you apply like loose glitter and stuff on your nail, I wouldn't top coat the glitter with this top coat but all around I think this top coat is great because it's cheap it works the main thing it works on foil which usually you usually use gel for and um, I think it's just a great top coat all around I wouldn't really use it for base coat unless I really want it to peel off fast but I really love it for a top coat so yeah my review is that it's great and it works great this video is not sponsored or anything I just really love this top coat and wanted to do a review about it and this is like my first reveal, guys. Tell me down in the comment section what you think, if you ever use this top coat, and what you think of my review, because I've never done one of these, and I'm super tired. <laughs>
Okay, have you ever filmed when you were really tired? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this review. I'll say it again, I love this top coat, and you can hit the i button if you want to see all of my designs that I've used this top coat with, and I think one of them is like, I foil my nails perfectly with this top coat, so you can uh, watch that. I thought it's a great video, I'm unplugging my own videos in a video, what am I doing? I don't even know, I'm so tired. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this, tell me what you think down below, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe if you want to. This has been Cheap Nails with Vanna. Goodbye! You know, like in Princess Diaries, how'd she teach her how to wave again? It was like this or something? Because your hand would get tired if you're like this. So she was like, this or something? What was it? Does anyone remember that? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Like this? No, it was like this. No, it was like this. Was it? Was it like this? <laughs> no? I don't know what it was. I don't know. I'm gonna go to bed. Good night. Or goodbye. I probably upload this at 2 p.m. didn't I? And it's gonna be, I'm gonna be really tired and it's 2 p.m. when I upload this so it's gonna seem weird. Good night.